Our next speaker is Kerry Coons, CEO of Atlantica Tender Drilling. Kerry has more than 30 years' experience from the oil and gas industry, including 26 years with Neighbors International, where he worked in several different countries before becoming Vice President of International Offshore Operations. In 2007, he was one of the founders of Atlantica and has been the president and CEO of the company since. Over this period, Atlantica has grown from being just a rig concept into a four-rig operation with more than 300 employees worldwide. Kerry, look forward to getting your story. Thank you for the introduction. I'd like to also thank uh, High Tech Vision and ONS for giving me the uh, opportunity to speak about this growth story, Atlantica. Um, we'll go through it. It uh, casts over a period of seven years, and uh, hopefully I'll give you an overview of how we move through that. First of all, I want to talk about uh, what is the tender assist market. It's got a strange name, this tender assist. Um, it's not a commodity market, but I think I need to, uh, it deserves some explaining. Um, the history, I'll give you a timeline of what, uh, what we've done with this company since inception. What was successful, hurdles along the way. That's really another word for what didn't work so well. Um, challenges, where are we going from here? So a little bit about the tender assist market. Um, what do we do? What, what type of sector is this? It's not a jack-up, it's not a drill ship, it's not a semi. So what, we, what do we do? We come up with a vessel alongside an operator's facility, be it a platform or be it a TLP or be it a SPAR, but there has to be a facility that the operator has. And just for the benefit of the prior speaker, most of them are very unstandardized, okay? They're all different. In any case, the vessel comes alongside and then we erect what we call a mast equipment package. Others call it a derrick equipment set onto the platform. Most of these platforms are all multi-well platforms, various number of wells on the platforms, different sizes. Um, they all are similar in the fact that they all have surface BOPs. We drill with surface BOPs and they have surface wellheads. Um, the tender itself, the vessel itself, is really a support facility for the drilling. It supports the drilling. The unique part is the modular equipment that we erect onto the platform, onto the operator's platform. It bears weight on the platform. So during the